let's play some addition bingo. Okay, so for this game, we're going to first have to make our bingo board, and then we can, I'll show you how to play the game. So, to make our bingo board, any piece of paper will do, or I'm gonna use my whiteboard, right? So first I need to draw three lines down. One, two, three. And then I need to draw three lines across. Uh-oh. One, two, three. Okay, now that I have all these boxes on here, I'm going to fill them in with the numbers. I am going to be rolling two dice. So the numbers that I can use are 2 all the way up to 12. Now, I'm going to have some extra spaces, so I'm going to have to put numbers more than once, and that's okay. And I'll tell you what happens when we roll one of those. So I'm going to fill them in. I don't know that I want to put them in order, so I'm going to do, but I'm going to write them in order so I don't skip one. 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. 2 up to 12 is the numbers that I can add together on the dice. Now I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 empty spaces. So I get to pick 5 numbers that I'd like to put a second time. So I think I'm going to put another 6 down here and maybe... Uh, 10 over here, uh, 8 up here, 9, 5. Now, when I roll those numbers, I only get to cover one, but if I then roll it again, I get to cover it a second time. And then I'm going to need something to cover up my spaces, so I'm going to use my chips but you can cover your spaces with whatever you want at home. Toys, cars, gummy bears, whatever you'd like. Okay, so next, I'm gonna roll my dice, right? I'm gonna roll two dice, or I can roll the same dice twice. Oh, okay, so I got, let's see if I can bring them over here. I got a six and a six. So if I add those together, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I got a twelve, so I get to cover my twelve space on my bingo board. Okay, does that make sense? Now I get to roll again. Ooh, a two and one more. Three, right? So I get to cover my three. Oh, look at me, I'm already making a line. Now you can play until the board is full, or you can play until you make a bingo. If you're playing alone, you can play ha, play however you want. If you're playing with a partner, you can um, play until somebody wins. You could also play this right like connect four, where if I was the second person, I would use a different color and I could block somebody from making a bingo, however you want to play. But I'm just playing regular bingo. Okay, six plus four is 10. My goodness, okay. Five plus six is 11. Oh my goodness. Sparkly's doing well today. Oop. Five plus one is six. Okay. Two plus two is four. Now, I rolled a six, but I only covered one of my sixes. And I rolled a 10, and I only covered one of my 10s, right? Ooh, 4 plus 3 is 7. 5 plus 2 is 7, but I don't have another one. So I don't get to do anything that roll. 2 plus 4 is 6. I do have a second 6, so I get to cover it up. Okay. 5 plus 6 is 11. I must have already covered my 11 because I don't see another one. 
Five plus three is eight. If I put it there, I've got a bingo, right? I've covered up my whole row. Awesome. Now, I can play this with subtraction too if I want to. I just have to use different numbers. The highest number I can get on the two dice when I roll, when I subtract, is a five, and the lowest number I can get is a zero. So, the good thing about using a whiteboard marker is that I can erase and do them again, but you can always just clear, clear your pieces off and play a second time, right? So if I'm doing subtraction, my numbers are going to repeat a lot because I can only use five, zero through five. So zero, one, two, three, four, five, zero, one, two, three, four, five, zero, one, two, three. Okay. So now, if I'm doing this subtraction game, I roll my two dice. I got five and a two. So five, take away two, five, four, three. I get to cover a three. Okay? Then I roll again. Six, uh-oh, uh-oh, where's the six? Six take away one is six, five, right? Okay? Two take away two is zero. Six take away three, six, five, four, three is three. Four take away three, four, three, two, one. Six take away two, six, five, four. Four take away two, four, three, two. Six take away four, six, five, four, three, two. Ooh, I'm getting close to a couple bingos here, right? Five take away three, five, four, three, two. I've run out of twos. Four take away two, four, three, two. Just that I didn't have any twos left. Uh oh. Five take away three is also two. Three take away one is two. Oh my goodness, I should have filled my whole board up with twos. Six take away five. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bingo. So I can play this game alone. I can play this game with a partner. I can play this game in a whole bunch of different ways. I could try to fill up my whole board. I could work towards a bingo. I could work towards just getting the corners, however you want to play. Do your own addition and subtraction bingo at home and take a picture. Send me a picture when you're done. Good luck.